Hey, today in this video we are going to solve one problem statement in Java. In that problem statement we are given an array. Now we have to reverse the array with less number of iterations. Before going to write code for this problem statement, first we will understand the logic for this problem statement. Okay. If you are observed here, this is our given array. We will write one for loop to iterate over an array. In first iteration of the for loop, we will swap the elements which are present at first index and last index. In second iteration, we will swap the elements which are present at second index from the starting and second index from the ending. Like this, we will swap the elements until we will get our resultant array. If you are observed here, how many iterations are required to get our resultant array? Three iterations. What is the length of the array? Six. That means from this it is clear we will get our resultant array within array dot length by two iterations. Now dive into the coding part. Here I write array as it is which is given in the problem statement. Now I wrote one for loop. I declare two variables f and l. f start from first index, l start from last index array dot length minus one. Okay. We will run this for loop until f less than array dot length by two. In each iteration, we will in increment the value of f. Si simultaneously, we will decrement the value of l. Here I declare one variable, named it as tem. Here I am going to store the value of array of f. Here in first iteration, what is the value of f? Zero. That means I will be store one in this temp variable. Okay. Next, I am going to perform swap operation. What is the f value in first iteration? Zero. At uh, to zeroth index, I will store the value present at last index. At the last index, I will be stored the value present at zeroth index. Like this, we will perform swap operation for remaining numbers as well. Finally, we will get our resultant array. To confirm whether our array is reversed or not, I wrote this for loop. The purpose of this for loop is just printing array as it is. After executing this program, I got array. If you are observe input array with output, what is our input array? 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Our output array? 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That means we have successfully reversed our array. I hope you understood for this problem statement. If you are like, please share with your friends and support me by subscribing. And don't forget to press the bell icon for getting more updates from the my channel whenever I uploaded videos. Thanks for watching.